I want to go to the book of uh, Matthew. Matthew 16. Matthew 16. Yes. Start from verse, in fact, let's go to verse number 4. Matthew mm-hmm. 16 from verse number 4. Mm-hmm. A wicked and adulterous generation seeketh after a sign, and there shall no sign be given unto it, but the sign of the prophet Jonas, and he left them and departed. Now, this is the greatest, one of the greatest uh, part of scripture. Mm. You hear what Jesus is saying. Yes, Please listen, because this is the time to listen. Yes, really, I mm. wish I could mm. just kind of spare myself this all these hours uh-huh. and just <laughs> cut their heads in pieces, <laughs> open them up, put the brain, put it here, feed this we'll revelation into their brains <laughs> and open their spirit and feed it and just say, we're closing the broadcast and people <laughs> get excited, you know. Amen. Notice what Jesus said. said, mm-hmm. only a wicked and mm-hmm. adulterous generation mm-hmm. seeks for a miracle. Come on now. Mm. Wow. Mm. Come on. Now, if an adulterous generation or a wicked generation mm. seeks for a miracle, yes, sir. it simply means there is mm. something that a miracle does that mm. cancels out the plan of God. Ooh, come on now. Hallelujah. Glory. Let's, let's mm. repeat that mm. because yes. so many people didn't get it. Yes, sir. It means anytime you hear a miracle, has, a miracle has taken place. Mm. God's plan has been mm. canceled. Wow. It has been disturbed. Come on now. Hi. Hallelujah. You, you're still <laughs> not getting this. Glory. <laughs> so a miracle mm. cancels out God's plan. Mm. Come on now. So God's perfect plan does not include a miracle. Mm. Come on. Amen. Come on. When we provide miracle money, we have mm. disturbed God's plan. Mm. Hallelujah. When you say I've been healed of cancer, you have disturbed God's plan. Mm. Come wow. on. Wow. Amazing. When you say now because of a prophecy I received, now I have a miracle, you disturbed God's perfect plan. Amen. Hallelujah. Mm. Come on. Mm. I can see some people are getting it. <laughs> hey, read the verse again because some yes, people, sir. I think, are just joining now and they're wondering, what are you talking about? Matthew 16 from verse number 4. Mm-hmm. A wicked and adulterous generation seeketh after a sign, and there shall no sign be given unto it, but the sign of the prophet Jonas. And he left them and departed. So a wicked and adulterous generation seeketh for a sign. Now, mm-hmm. I want us to look at the word Mm. A wicked generation. So that you know it's not wicked the way you think, but it involves that. It is the word poneros, mm. which simply means a, a, a generation full of labor. Mm. Come on now. Nine to five people. Mm. Aye, aye, aye. I don't know if you're getting this now. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Pressed and harassed by labors. That's the, mm. that's the Greek definition of it in the Greek. Harassed Pressed and harassed. Labor. It actually says harassed by labors. Read it from your, <laughs> your Greek uh, dictionary. <laughs> this is amazing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Full of labors. Mm-hmm. B. Anoy- annoyances. Uh-huh. A. One A. A. Pressed and harassed by labors. Mm. B. Go to B. B. Bringing toils. Annoyances. annoyances. Perils. perils. Mm. Of a time, a time full of, of peril. peril. To, to Christian faith and steadfastness. And what? Causing pain and trouble. A generation that causes pain and trouble, mm. that is harassed by labor, <laughs> is the one looking for miracles. <laughs> Ooh, Let me give you um, mm. truth you don't want to hear. Mm. I don't know if you are, if you are there. I want to yes, give sir. you truth you don't want to hear. Mm-hmm. Mm, um, I want to give you some truth you don't want to hear. Yes, sir. Looking at this scripture again. Mm-hmm. This is the truth that you don't want to hear. Mm. There are prayer requests I never do. Come on, come on now. See, if I look at your prayer request mm. and you look at mine, mm. I can look at you. If we are going to exchange prayer requests here, you give me your prayer request and I give you a prayer request. Mm. Mine might have five things and yours might have 200. Mm. I don't know if you're getting this. Come on now. Mm. Read the scripture again. Read the scripture so, again. Matthew 16, 4. Mm-hmm. A wicked and adulterous generation. A wicked and adulterous generation. Mm. Seeketh after a sign. Wait, just relax. So we look for a miracle, mm-hmm. a sign and a wonder, mm. if we are wicked. Mm. If we are wicked, we look for miracles. Mm. 
Mm. This is the reason why American churches with white people, British churches with white people, uh, um, uh, Caucasian churches with white people mm. are full of crowds that are prosperous. Mm. And our kind of churches mm -hmm. are full of what? Broke people mm. looking for a miracle. That's right. Mm -hmm. They get the miracles. Mm. Of course, Jubilee Angel performs miracles. Mm -hmm. So and so performs miracles. That's but right. if you notice mm. that we have a lot of testimonies, mm -hmm. but the same people will come to look for another miracle. Amen. Look at Joel Austin's mm. church. Mm. Hundreds of, mm. of people, thousands of people, in That's fact, right. we went there, it fits about mm. 16,000. Um, I had an opportunity to meet him and meet, meet the mother. Um, I spoke to the mother in, at length, mm. you know, and then spoke about uh, Joel Austin's father, just, just with, with the mother of Joel Austin there. And to look at that 16,700 and something cedar, mm -hmm. and you have people that are prosperous in that location. That's right. I'm not saying miracles are not good. Mm -hmm. Just listen to what Jesus said. He said, only a wicked generation looks for a miracle. Now, and we mm -hmm. looked at the word wicked in the Greek. Mm -hmm. It is the word what? Poneros, yes, which means full of labors, mm. perio and toil. Mm. Mm. What does he say again? It says, praise the Arabs harassed by labors. Yes, so a, a laborious generation, mm. people that are just nine to five mm. or nine to nine. Hallelujah are the ones who are looking for a miracle. Come on now. Mm. Jesus is saying it's wrong to look for miracles. Come on. Mm. We're going to deal Amazing. with that. Mm. So, so, if I look for a miracle, I have disturbed God's plan because God is the one saying only a wicked generation is looking for a sign. For a miracle. Wow. Amazing. I don't know whether you're flowing or you're not. Yes, sir. sir. Mm. Yeah, I want you to getting flow it. and follow. Yes, sir. People are getting it, sir. Uh, Lubna is saying, Wow. A miracle cancels out, cancels out God's plan. Now this Every is miracle moment. you have received in the past is canceled out God's plan. Let me just shock you a little bit. It, is, it was never God's plan to have heaven, mm. to have people to stay in heaven. Come on. Never God's plan. Mm. To prove to you that it is not God's plan, mm. he only uses it for rapture. And after Afterwards, we have to come years, back here. We're come back on. on earth. Only seven years. That's it. And when we are in heaven for seven years, remember, mm. a thousand a day in the house of God is like a thousand years away. That means we can we might do a second day and feel like we've done. We feel like we've done a second when we've done seven years. Wow. Mm. <laughs> it is seven years to people who are left here, not to us. Mm. To us, it will look like a second. Wow. And guess where we come to here. Yes. And after the Armageddon, what happens? Mm -hmm. We have a new heaven, not that one. Mm -hmm. So God's plan was never heaven. Mm -hmm. God's plan was never a miracle. Amen. He never intended for Adam and Eve Amen. to sin. Come on. Mm -hmm. And come out of his presence. That's right. He never. Mm -mm. If Eve had not sinned, would we be queuing for miracles? No way. No. So that no means way. God's plan was not so. Yes, when right. Jesus is asked about marriage, he said, go back to the beginning. Mm -hmm. That means the plan of God was the beginning. Mm -hmm. So if Adam then sinned, everything about God's plan was put into tatters. Everything gone, mm. went wrong. That's right. So if everything went wrong, we have to go back to the beginning and say, what was God's what plan? Was he says, and Adam and Eve walked in the cool of the day, mm. talking to God. That's that was right. God's plan. Never heaven, never a miracle, never prophecy. Mm. If Eve had decided, yes, sir. I'm not sinning, you better angel as a prophet will not be here. Mm, come on. Why would you need a prophet? Would to do what? Right. Any of the gifts. Would, need would, would you do need any gifts no. to do what with the gifts? No. You talk to God in the cool of the day. That's it. It was the millennium, the millennial reign. That's it. The yeah. same thing when we get to the millennial reign. Why That's would it. you need a prophet to do what for you? No. So you get what I'm trying to say here. Sir. Everyone you go to to seek for a miracle mm -hmm. is not necessary if you follow the plan of God. Amen. 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 Oh. You, you, some of you are taking your time to get this. I get you. I get you. Now, now I want you to see something here. Yes, Remember, we are stewards. What was Adam and Eve's duty in the garden? Mm -hmm. You put them in the garden of Eden to do what? The, what they were they? Tend to the garden. Stewards. Multiply. Multiply. Yes, sir. Notice the plan of God was simply access to resources. Mm. It wasn't ownership. Ownership is only for people who are losing. Come on. Let me explain. Mm -hmm. Look at the parable of the uh, prodigal son. Mm -hmm. He said, give me what I, 
on what is and Jumi, I, yeah. what is Jumi, and I'll go. That's right. To another country. Yeah. And when he got there, he couldn't pay. He got into bills because he wanted to own. The moment he said, give me what is mine, he became an owner. He lost. UJ, Levi, Seth, Jude. Don't wake up thinking who paid the bills. Mm. Why? They have access to my money. Mm. So they don't even need to think about it. When you have access, you don't need the miracles you're looking for. Money is to give you an option. It is not the thing that you need. You need option. Watch this. Mm. I was going to America one time and, and I want to take my keys and, and think, let's book a hotel. And Dr. Rodney Howard said, hey, just come here, bring your kids. Stay at my mm. house. Guess what? My money is useless now. That's mm. it. Why? I now have access mm. to a mansion. That's right. And I'm staying there with my kids. Brilliant time we've ever had in America was with Dr. Rodney Howard. Mm. Now imagine I'm in that location. Mm. I didn't pay to be in that house. Mm -hmm. I, I, when I got there, I just said, I don't need a hotel here. This is it. And I'm in there looking at this book that they sign. All these generals have been there, you know. I'm talking about who, who is who in Christianity has wow. been there. Kenneth Hagin, uh, all these, um, Joyce Mayer, all these, they, they signed that book and they were there. Wow. He just said to God, give me a place where men of God can come and rest. Wow. And I was chosen to be part of that. Wow. And I'm in there just thinking, I didn't pay to be here. Mm -hmm. Guess what? My money, though I had it, has been suspended. Why? Because I have access. Money is not needed when you have access. And Adam and Eve had access. Mm -hmm. But what they were told to do was to manage. Mm -hmm. Bills come to people who lose access. Mm. Come on. I don't know if you're getting yes, it. Sir. If you say I'm paying my bill, guess what? You don't have access to someone who can pay those bills. Mm -hmm. mm. Amen. You just don't have access. That's true. It's not that you needed money. You needed somebody who can cancel out that bill. It's now true. hear this. Mm. So what were they? They were simply what? Stewards. stewards. That's right. And what is the difference between a steward and, um, and an owner? The owner is the responsibility to take care of what they own. Mm -hmm. uh, and the steward just tends and looks after. And they know the thing is not their own. The ultimate responsibility. They're taking care of something on behalf of somebody. That's right. All right? Yes, sir. But they can make use of it. Mm -hmm. Now hear this. The plan of God was simply for us to manage his resources. Mm. So management cancels out a miracle. Come on. Mm. As long as Adam and Eve were managing rightly, they didn't need to be chased out of that garden. Mm. That's right. So evictions came mm. when they failed to manage. Mm. And then they were in need of a miracle. That's right. So miracle cancel out management. Come on. The reason why the black church, that as we call it, or the African church as we call it, mm -hmm. is full of people running for miracles is because they are bad managers. Mm. They fail to manage. They fail they to have. manage what God has given them. Mm. The biggest problem we have in Africa right now is the ability to manage resources. Mm. Imagine Africa is the richest continent on earth mm. and is the poorest. Mm. Yeah, that's... It doesn't make sense. What we have done is we have failed to manage the resources that God has given us. That's right. So, and it doesn't just go to, to governments because remember what the Bible says about governments. Mm. If the righteous rule, mm. the people are at peace. That's right. And it says, remember to pray for those who rule. That means mm. if the government is failing to rule, the church has failed to pray. Now you didn't get that. Mm -hmm. Remember the Bible says we shall disciple nations. That's right. To have the whole nation mm -hmm. is your Bible study. Yes. You know, your cell group. Yeah. To say, what, 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 what country do you, do you lead? You say, my cell group is St. Lucia, the whole country. <laughs> amazing. It's amazing. That's it. It's amazing. Yeah. You look at Pastor Chris ministering and you've got 1.8 billion, 2.2 billion gadgets tuning in. That's when somebody's discipling half of the world. That's amazing. Yeah. That's crazy. That's Even crazy. if you tell somebody, no, God, it's not possible. No, the ticker is counting. It's there. I've That's been crazy. there. I saw it. The yeah. ticker counting. Okay, right. let's give in. Let's, let's argue that maybe somebody mm -hmm. had three gadgets open. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's why the ticker went to 2.2 billion. Okay, three gadgets. Mm -hmm. Let's say it divided by three. We're still going to go uh, uh, over to about 800 million people watching somebody. Mm -hmm. One person. That's amazing. If we say everyone was holding two, we are still on one billion. Mm -hmm. One person. What has happened is when somebody knows how to manage a process, mm. how to manage what God has given them, 
So the failure to manage the resources that God has given us Amen. has caused us to look for miracles. Mm -hmm. That's why most people who look for miracles are my type. Wow. Failure to manage resources that you were given. Mm -hmm. Most broke people look for miracles. Mm, that's right. Need a miracle right there and there. All right. Let's mm -hmm. give you an example. Mm -hmm. If I say put your prayer request there, mm -hmm. you say I need a job. I don't need it. That's right. That means if we are standing, two of us standing here, mm -hmm. guess what? Your prayer request list, mm -hmm. I've removed one of it. Mm. That's right. I don't know if you're flowing with this. <laughs> <laughs> so, so many people are not getting this, you know. Your prayer request and mine mm -hmm. are not the same. Mine is not on basic needs. Why? Because I have money to go and buy the bread. Mm. You will be praying for bread. Mm. Or praying for a job to get the money in order to buy the bread. bread I already have the money to buy the bread. Mm. So guess what? My, the prayer request when it comes to that, I don't have it. Mm -hmm. For a job, I don't have it. For peace in my house, when money is there, trust me. Peace will be there. I've experienced in this. <laughs> peace normally is there. All right. You know what the peace we're talking about? Jesus said, peace I give unto you, not the peace as the, the world, world gives. gives. Big right. difference. Mm -hmm. So don't confuse those two peace. Yes, sir. Peace, peace. No, don't confuse the two. So you have a, a, a problem, a disease that has gone in the church now mm -hmm. that we think we need a miracle. Mm -hmm. We don't need a miracle. Notice this. Mm -hmm. It is a crime for a Christian to look for a miracle in church. The Bible says he is, when he went up on high, he gave some gifts. Amen. What? Gift of miracles, Teaching. gift of faith, all that. And he made some evangelists. He made some ministry gifts, mm -hmm. which are apostle, evangelist, teacher, pastor, you know, mm -hmm. prophet. Mm -hmm. Five-fold ministry when you went up and gave the gift, the, the ones we call nine, although they are not nine mm -hmm. in the book of Corinthians. Yes, they That's are right. nine, but in the book of Romans, they add, uh, you know, they, they, they increase. Mm -hmm. So if you look at that, you realize mm -hmm. he is given when he went up on high. That's he right. distributed gifts. That's right. Gave gifts to men. He gave gifts to men. Mm -hmm. But why do we need gifts? We now have things that need fixing. We now have things that need fixing. Did God create this world with a need to be fixed? No. It was perfect. Amen. Somebody messed up the system of Amen. God. Now we are looking for gifts. It's amazing, yeah. To fix what, was, what went wrong. Amen. What we caused mm -hmm. to go wrong mm -hmm. is what we're fixing. Amen. That's right. So when somebody says, I'm a prophet, mm. uh, angel is a prophet. Mm. When I say prophesy, can I prophesy? People mm. say, yay. All they're seeing is a man trying to fix what people messed up. Amen. That's true. That's so true. But that man would not have been needed mm -hmm. if you managed well your resources. That's right. He says for the perfecting of the saints. Perfect. That means something so the went saints wrong. Now need perfecting. Now need perfecting. Yet we were we were okay. They were created perfect. Notice here, yeah, <laughs> somebody mm -hmm. can create a car mm -hmm. that he will die and live here, and he's still working. That means inside you has you have got the ability to create something that durable mm -hmm. that can go for a long time. That's right. That can outlive you. Mm, yes, sir. If you can produce something that perfect, why can't you be that perfect? Oof, yeah. Mm. Come on now. Yes, sir. Oh, people mm. are excited that people mm. produce medication for some uh, disease. Mm -hmm. Guess what? They produced medication to fix a disease. Mm -hmm. Yet they themselves can get sick with something else. Mm. Now, from us is coming that perfection, mm -hmm. that drug that is perfect. Now, watch That's this. Right. So we see that um, Christians are broke because they want miracles. Mm. They don't seek to look for a management style. If I right now, if I say, uh, meet me at nine, I'll tell you the secret for prosperity. Everyone is expecting mm -hmm. some mambo jumbo. Mm -hmm. Just do A, B, C and go around your house four times yeah. and cry nine times yeah. and then take one stone and put it next to the gate yeah. and go and sleep. You will see. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Put five pound note under your mat. Under your mat, yeah. And then <laughs> speak these times. words and you'll see what will happen. <laughs> and that's the mi mindset of everybody. It's, uh... We are looking for miracles because we've messed up. Mm -hmm. I want to see what some people are saying here so that we... We go, we go, yes, we go. Uh, people are getting a sale. Uh, we've got on YouTube, Grace and Muna saying, uh, getting you 100% because I'm staying here for uh, free of charge in a very nice wide location not being racial, 
in brackets, even uh-huh. the whole of last year, no bill or what with free Wi-Fi. It's only now I have to buy data. So but they got.